So hello, welcome one and all to what is certainly in terms of international football in Latin America, the ultimate grudge match. Two absolute superpowers who also happen to be neighbours on a continent widely recognised as football's home. It is a rivalry that has a history which lasts well over a century and has of course been ranked top of all footballing rivalries by media and supporters alike. It comes as little surprise then that this game is considered to be international football's equivalent of the Super Classico. The 11 of Brazil, the 11 of Argentina, some of them friends, many foes in club football lining up for a united cause. Some beautiful scenes here inside the Minerao. It certainly retains all of its original character despite all of the modernizations and modifications of recent times. They have thrown down the gauntlet with that anthem, now to match it. Call this a friendly, but the crowd clearly doesn't think so. No, in actual fact, the way. Well, I think we know what we're in for, whatever the circumstances that exist when these two meet. Losing really isn't an option, making this another intense, feisty clash, which should keep everyone on edge. The fans are more nervous than the players to me, confirming an atmosphere of, of angst. Try telling them there's nothing riding on this. So it's away we go then. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Nicholas Otamendi. He's a, a fine defender, both in the air and... Richarlison! There it is! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Brazil have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Because of that first goal now, it's a great opportunity to make it one-way traffic and add to this lead. Well played, he saw that coming. He spotted the run and played him through. Face to face, Richarlison! In he goes again! And yes, it's there! Two up, too easy! How many more to come? He was so alert to the possibilities there, great stuff. But for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. Things starting to look very comfortable. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. The referee's awarded a free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Celso comes out on top in a really physical duel. Acuna. It's a loose ball. Gets it back. It's Di Maria. 
It's on a plate. And Martinez! Danilo tries to get it forward quickly. Di Maria's to great lead! Oh, just needed a better contact. Brazil can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Arthur. Coutinho. Look at the defender bombing forward. In with a header! That's offside. Yes, it is. Keeper's got good distance on that. Di Maria. Tries to locate someone up front. Arthur battles to win it back. Richarlison. A real chance if he can get through. Coutinho tried to play it through. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Richarlison gets flagged offside. of the first half, full pack on the first 45 minutes. Brazil just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown, convincing and controlled. Brazil ahead 2-0, and they are looking good. And that's the start of another 45 minutes. Los Celso. Richarlison. Di Maria. Acuna. Aguero. Aguero really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. There's a long ball. Has he picked him out? Richarlison! <laughs> Surely that deserved better. Richarlison certainly did his part with a lovely pass, and unfortunately, the loveliness ceased there. And it's played forward. Richarlison looks to dink on it. Has a hit! They are rampant! And they are pulling clear here. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Three without reply. This is...